I completely take this back now. <laughs> this is, um, yeah, not the best trail. Good morning. Good morning. And welcome to Marira. Now, first things first, behind us, well, actually behind us here, not we're not camper. quite yet in motorhome <laughs> life yet. We um, wish, but it's not. We're still four weeks off at this point. Or well, weirdly enough, at the time you guys see this video, because our videos are two to three weeks behind, we're probably only a week or so away. So, mm. look, if you came to Marira 25 years ago, it would be nothing but literally a handful of houses and a fishing port but over the last 25 years or so it's built up to be well Lots it's like of holiday home paradise isn't it yeah but we're gonna have a look around because there's quite a few things to see here and i think this afternoon we're planning on taking a bit of a hike yeah to find some very pretty and secluded swimming coves yeah. I can today. see why though. This is actually really pretty. By the way, we know Mariah quite well, don't we? We've been here lots. Been here quite a few times. We originally had our bank branch here. Mm -hmm. um, but the very first day we arrived in Spain, yeah, we actually came here and had a meal on the seafront down here to kind of celebrate yeah. our arrival. Our first days as residents. Yeah. Although we say we've been to Marara quite a few times, we've not actually been down here for what, a couple of years now? Yeah. Something like that. And I've forgotten just how pretty this place is. It is lovely. It is lovely. And this here though is the main beach. And we're not actually planning, I don't think, on spending much time down at this beach. No. Because we're gonna try and, like I said earlier, find some of these secluded coves that are often round the edge here somewhere but this is actually really pretty this beach I do like this beach and it's also very popular with snorkelists yeah apparently around this side piece here right here yeah kind of wander over and show you but in this side area here is really popular with snorkeling and that because this area apparently has a really vibrant marine life. The door is open. It said temporarily closed. So can we actually have a nose inside there? I don't know. Shall we see? Go on then. In all the years we've come here, that's always been shut. Okay. It's gratis? It's Perfecto, gratis. Oi, senor. Right, so it's going to be a bit echoey in here, yeah. but this is the first time we've ever managed to come and see inside this. It's not a proper castle, is it? It's more of a it's tower. A, yeah, the it's a, the a bastion, I think they called it. But it even, I checked it this morning and Google Maps still said it was temporarily closed. Right. Oh, that's a shame. You can't go up there. Oh, rude. How rude indeed. I can kind of go up these stairs. Yeah. And have a look out there. That's a massive shame. It is. I'd love to have gone up there. Well, perhaps we can go up the one the other end. We'll ask the man, see if he can let us up there. <laughs> the one thing we have found in here that's quite useful, we were saying about the town of Mariah, it was like 25 years ago, just a tiny, well, I mean tiny little fishing village. And they've actually got a photo just here. 
that shows this, this is tiny. I mean, Mariah are now stretching right off into the distance. Mm -hmm. Both sides. 25 years ago, this place looked like that. Look at the state the castle was in before they rebuilt it in the 80s. Mm. They'd robbed no end of a stone and used it in the church, apparently. But this was, according to the board, this was the first fortification yeah. built on the Valencian coast. Really? Apparently so. Stop the pirates. Stop the pirates. Oh, there wasn't a lot to see in there, but like I said, at least we got to see it before we leave. Yeah, I'm just pleased it's open. Yeah. But this is, um, Marari is lovely. I mean, this is pretty, all this Tosca stone that's all been again cut out. Yeah. We explained all about the Tosca stone in our video we did in, one of the first videos we did in Javier. Um, but what a location. There that's the port. Nice so the old town's gonna to be just behind it somewhere. Well, this is, this is part of it, apparently according to the map. But it's obviously been reused quite a lot. So this will be the, the start of the old town that we're coming into. And uh, I've got to be honest with you, it's really lovely. All the way down here, and that's down the seafront and into these winding roads, you've got these little restaurants that are just kind of tucked into the, the side street. I mean, look at this one here. This is uh, taking up most of this road, Alley. Mm. I'm actually shocked how many people are here. Yeah. Still very lively. It I suppose is. though that's probably got a lot to do with the fact that Mariah is not just a, a very popular holiday resort. It's very popular here with people from all over Europe come and come here to live permanently. Yeah. So it does have a vibrant, permanent population. That's the word population. I was looking for. These two huge, great trees. And they've got the green stuff underneath like, it. Yeah, carrier bag underneath. Let's talk about these big ones here, the carrier bag underneath, stopping it landing on the, the, the eating people, the yeah. patrons. That's only three trees, I've just realized. Yeah. They used to do it at the one round the corner. Yeah. But it looks like the trees have now been taken out and been uh, replaced with cacti and things. But yeah, that's, that's cool. Though. Lovely. And also, so if birds are sitting in the trees, you don't get poop on you like you used to in that restaurant in Javier. Poop protectors. Absolutely. Once again, I'm walking down this road, and we do this quite often in various locations. I don't recognise this road. I don't think we've ever come down this part, have we? Uh, I think we may have seen it. But I don't remember ever walking down, because this is really pretty little kind of, what do you call it, like a shopping street. We usually, because we park the other end, yeah. we usually come straight down the main straight road the main and road. not through here. This is lovely. But it's all, they've kind of boutiqued and barred everything, haven't they? Yeah. So, although this is the old town, it doesn't look like it because they've kind of built on top. But I mean, look at these. Mm. The essence is still there. Most definitely okay. have not been up there this ever. This is quite pretty. It's stunning. I think you probably get a good view from up there over. Yeah. I think should we go up? Look. Yeah. We, we well, it's the definitely... nautical club down there, which we know where it is. We've yeah. been to. But let's go up here first. Yeah, we've never been up this. The, the what was it? The portet. Portet. Top cocktail bar looks cool. There's other over there, yeah. You can obviously walk all the way around that lump there as well. Yeah. Oh, look at that beastie yacht. Yeah. Looks very dark and menacing from here. <laughs> but that, all this over here, so 
We believe we'll get around the other side of this, don't we? Yeah. Start seeing the cave, or not caves, coves. Coves and there's caves. Yeah. Coves de larches. That's a stunning view. Mm. But I think what we're going to do now is head back down, try and find somewhere to get a bite to eat yes. before we jump, go back, jump in the car quickly and head over to these coves. You ready? Should we see if the restaurant that we had our first meal at here is open? That would be quite fitting. That would be lovely. Let's go and have a look. Yeah. We've definitely found the restaurant. It's there. But apparently it's now just changed hands. So... Yeah. I, you still want to eat here though, don't you? Because it's, yeah. it's kind of fitting that this is the first place we had a bite to eat or lunch, a meal out in a restaurant. Yeah. Know what to call it As when we residents. first came to Spain so yeah we got to eat here before we leave yeah different name but same place come on in he's even putting his umbrella out bless him bless him come on hola hola buenas tardes donde yes very well like en, en el sombre yeah oh. perfect it feels weird being back here mm. It's now called Brisa y Mar. And we've ordered the menu of the day now. Mm. First things first, Mariah is not as cheap as most places. Although it's still only 18 euros for three courses. No extras, is it? Yeah, think... just three courses, 18 euros. These are really nice. And the, the sauce, excuse fingers, but the sauce has got like a oh, yeah. uh, picante, hot, spicy, yeah. a bit of a kick to it, it's nice. Mm. Mm. Oh. oh, hello. Oh, that looks good. Thank you. Oh, I've got antlers. Oh, they're crunchy things. I've got antlers. Gracias. And cheese. Oh. Please enjoy me. We will, thank mm. you. I've got to say, I've got spaghetti and meatballs. And that is stunning. And Alison's got... Dorada. Fish and chips. Yes. Mm. How's everything? Perfect. How's everything? Yes. That's lovely, thank you. Perfect. Yes, thank you very much. Please enjoy. I, I've just fallen in love with somebody else. Well, something else, not somebody else. I know I love him. He's bringing me cheesecake. He is bringing you yeah. cheesecake. He, he's yeah. the new love of my life. Hi. <laughs> Gracias. Oh, that looks oh. nice. Cheesecake. <sighs> that was actually nicer than the meal we had here the first time. Yeah, that's I really lovely. enjoyed that. If you're in the area, I really recommend those guys. Yeah. Could not have been more helpful. No, they were very sweet. Mm. Right, get back to the car and then go on this hike and find this beach. Yes. Right, well, we've moved the car. So nice what we think is the part, yeah. Very steep getting up and down to this place. It's, I mean, up and down, kind of go up and over stuff, but we're in a parking space. We're not sure if we're supposed to be paying it. We're going to go and ask down the road. We think this is the start of the actual hike, but we think there's an access to the beach down there. Yeah, we're just going to pop up here and just try and see. What okay, well, there's a very, very well-maintained path up here. Mm. I wonder if that's like that all the way along. I don't know. Oh, you can smell the carobs. Yeah. It's... Oh. I think we'll go down here and have a look. Looks like a good uh, viewpoint. Oh, our swimmers in the oh, bag. Wow. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Hiccups. Oh, wow. Okay. That's a bit lovely. And that's down to that cove beach there. There's a walkway running off around the side of the mountain there. That'll be to the, the next the one. Cliff, yeah. That got... water looks stunning though. Mm. Still the sea breeze. Yeah. I think what we need to do now is actually go and find out if we need to pay for parking or what we need to do. Mm. Yeah. Let's go and find out and we'll let you guys know in a sec. Well, we don't want to wait till tomorrow, do we? 12 euros. Well, that got a little painful. <laughs> we used to paying like 50 cents for two hours parking, not 12 euros. Old days, I used to think I'm the problem. 
that I was way too sensitive, reacting way too much. That's a bit impressive, isn't it? That's a bit special. That is lovely, look at it. This is a proper paradise cove type of thing, isn't it? Yeah. But look how clear the water is. Someday we will collide some place where we can hide our space. Forget the world outside. We created some of it. And we get a cave. Are we going down? Of course. <laughs> of course. So where are we going now? Have a look in here. This place is incredible. <laughs> oh, this looks cool. Look at the rock pool. This looks awesome. Ah? Uh -huh. This looks awesome. Should have put the swimmers on, you're right. Yeah. I'm going for a splash. Wow. What a cave again, this is like very similar to ones we saw at Covertel Arda. But there's a group of French lads and they've dived in here and just vanished under there. You, you can probably hear them chatting, but I can can't hear see them, them. But I can't see them anymore. Uh, what are we going to do? Should we find somewhere to get changed into swimmers? Yeah. yeah? We've got changed. I'm in the swim where I'm not naked. <laughs> um, and we're going to head back up here. Then there's a path that I believe runs all the way around the top here to another cove on the other side. Not a clue what it's going to look like. We'll see in, well, probably about five, ten minutes, hopefully. You can tell we haven't uh, done anything like this for about 10 to 12 weeks. You're not kidding. This climb has actually taken our breath away a little bit. <laughs> hey. Indeed. And it's on a proper constructed path. Oh. My thighs and my butt are complaining quite substantially. But it's not oh. actually that far of a walk to be fair today. I don't know if we're going to find these other coves. I don't know how far around this goes. If it doesn't, we're heading back to that one because that's stunning. Go and have a swim in that beautiful crystal clear water. Oh. We've Again, got boys you can there. see down there. Boys there as well, look. Perhaps that's a... Do they have Snorkeling in and out or... zone or something. Who I knows? don't know because these two aren't snorkeling anywhere near it. Oh gosh. Wow. I don't know what that is, was, is meant to be, but that's fairly impressive. That's incredible. It's like all the lines down it. It looks like a tree that's been cut in half. That's amazing. But that's definitely rock. But the beauty is we'll get closer because this path heads down. It does. Uh, heads down here, then back up right next to it, I think. Yeah, it looks like it. Although this bit looks a bit more sketchy. Another uh, fun walk, this one. Hey. Although I've got to say, unlike some of the ones we've done, this is, you know, it, it's got steps. They've not, it's not climbing up and down rocks, is it? No. You wouldn't want to get that wrong, though. That actually looks like it's been cut. It does, doesn't Look it? Look how flat that surface is. It looks amazing. It goes a long way down. It does. What does the board say? Oh, it does go a very long way down. Oh, oh look at that down there. I can't actually see the bottom. Oh, yes, I can just if That's I take amazing. my glasses off. Wowzers. Doesn't that look like it's been cut though? Yeah. What does the board say? That's amazing. What a piece of landscape. So what did you just say it was? It's a fault line. Oh, this? Fire. This uh, thing here is actually a, a fault line from yeah. an earthquake. 
Fire del Rio Blanc or del Moraig. So that's what happens when fault lines split and move then. Yeah. That's amazing. And the type of rocks that they are, are less resistant to erosion. So they've been eroded by the sea at the bottom, as you can see, and then the rest's dropped. That's amazing. That's is. incredible. I completely take this back now. <laughs> this is, um, yeah, not the best trail. Apparently now we've got to go down in that. That's a dead end down there. But I think of originally that went and weaved down to this trail down the bottom here. There's another one down there. So what I'm going to have to do is head back again. Well, we seem to kind of end up back here again, back at the fault line. I kind of get the feeling that used to be the trail, or the proper trail, heading off down there. But apparently, you're no longer allowed to actually... Did I just hear yep. people... There's people down there. Down there? Yep. I wonder if like that's I was those saying, mad they cut French that trail people. off. But, yeah, I'm dying to know who is... Well... More how. Oh, yeah. They must have swum round. It's the only way. Well, did they swim round or did they swim under? That's obviously who we just heard. Well, they got round there quickly. They've got, well, they've got all the gear. They've got the flippy flop things. Yeah. At least they've got tanks and stuff. Yeah. It makes me nervous look... when people go into caves and stuff <laughs> yeah. swimming without tanks. But they it are proper me... kitted up, those yeah. two. Yeah, they are. This is stunning round here, though. Just bad for your legs. Terrible. Well, good for your legs, but... So we're having brainwave after brainwave now. We've worked it all out. So this part here just takes you to that fault line thing. The actual trail um, is actually across the top of this ridge all the way across here. And right by where we parked the car was actually a set of stairs. I think we went up there, didn't we? And had a look over the edge, and that follows. Oh, yeah, yeah. that's the viewpoint there. Where the two. And then there's a path that lead, led off over these, this cliff edge. Yeah. Oh, we've got it completely wrong. But yeah. we're going to go and have a swim. All right. Made it back down to Cali Morag. Morag? Morag? Morag. I, I, I didn't actually More check something. with Google to see how it's spelled, uh, pronounced. And uh, we're going to go and get our, make our way to the far end, I think where there's still a bit of sun, sun left. Well, we, we've got our base camp. We're right by the sea. Yes. And jump in the water and set, but lesson learned. Right, so we came down the slope this side over to here. And I'm not going to turn the camera and face it that way. No. But if you ever get to come to this beach, don't go too much. Don't go too that far way. that way. That's getting at the nudest part. Yes. There's lots of, I was going to say people hanging out, but they literally are, yeah. There's crispy sausage galore. Let's go for a swim. Yes, please. Yeah. Okay, beach recommendation for this area has got to be this. Yeah. I know it's 12 euros and I know I'm a cheapskate and don't like paying for pretty much anything if I don't yeah, have to. Yeah, yeah. but, but this, it's is, lovely. this is gorgeous. Mm. This is beautiful. Just 
just like you. <sighs> That's a lovely day. Very nice day. We have thoroughly enjoyed today. Yeah. Mariah Stanning, lovely to go back to that restaurant, even though it's got new owners, but they were yeah. phenomenal. Food was lovely. But what a location to finish. Mm. That is absolutely incredible. But with that said, we'll see Can't you all next home. Sunday. Take, Take care. care. Bye for Bye. now. Bye.